Hey guys, the other day I went to the dump with my pickup and a utility trailer and when I got back I found out I didn't have left and right turn signals. The marker lights worked okay, but the left and right turn signals were completely out. Further investigation of the trailer wiring uh, revealed a short in them, but I'm still not getting any power out of the truck's trailer connector for the left and right turn signals. Quick research of the problem showed that most likely I blew a fuse, but why just the left and right turn signal? Let's go open up the fuse box and find out what's going on. Here's the engine compartment of my F-250 Super Duty. Do you see the fuse box anywhere in this picture? No, I don't either. And the reason why is Ford stuck this fuse box down in about the only available space. It was right down here. And to get the cover off requires squeezing two ears. There's, I've got one on one side. And I can't quite get the other one. I'll switch hands here. There. Out, out it comes. Now we have access to the fuses. So which one is the fuse for the trailer wire? Well, you'll need the service manual or the user manual to figure that out. Okay, after looking in the operator's manual for the truck, I found which one of these fuses is for the uh, trailer lights. And that is this fuse right here. That's for the left and right trailer lights. If you, uh, the, there's a separate fuse, I believe it's this guy here, uh, for the uh, parking lights or running lights on the trailer. Notice they didn't put them exactly side by side, did they? But that's the way it is and we'll just have to deal with it. I've already replaced the fuse, the blown fuse, I put in a 30 amp fuse because that's all I could get at the parts store. Uh, the original fuse here is a 25 amp fuse. But I figure that 30 amp will be okay. I've included photographs of the tra the fuse box fuse assignments at the end of this video for your reference. But it's certainly handy to know where this fuse box is and how to open it up. Because if you're on the side of the road at night, it's going to be a hell of a deal to get out. I already got several cuts trying to open this thing up. Because there's other clips, other ears on this that do not take the cover off they hold the box itself on. So you only want to try to squeeze those two ears. These two ears right here, they do the job. And they're the only ones that do the job. So there you have it. All right, I got a replacement fuse uh, for this from the auto parts store. It's the J case low profile fuse. That's what you want to get. Uh, the auto parts store only had the 30 amp and 20 amp, so I got the 30 amp. Uh, and what was original was a 25 amp fuse. Well, I installed the fuse and the both uh, turn signals now are working.
This is out of my owner's manual for the F-250. That's the fuse layout of the power distribution box inside the engine compartment. And it shows you the fuses numbers and what they they are used for. There's 100 trailer tow turn signals.